Bartax! What is your profession? <laughs> the Battle of Thermopylae, fought in 480 BC, was a pivotal clash between the invading Persian army of King Xerxes I and a small Greek force led by King Leonidas of Sparta. Despite being outnumbered by over 10 to 1, the Greeks, composed of 300 Spartans and approximately 7,000 other Greek soldiers, held the narrow pass of Thermopylae for three days, blocking Xerxes' advance into Greece. The Pass of Thermopylae, situated along the coastal road from northern Greece to southern Greece, was a strategic choke point, providing a narrow passage between the mountains and the sea. If Xerxes could conquer Thermopylae, he would have an unobstructed path to conquer the rest of Greece. Xerxes' invasion of Greece was a massive undertaking, involving an estimated 250,000 soldiers and a vast array of ships, making it one of the largest armies ever assembled in ancient history. Xerxes' goal was to avenge the defeat of his father, Darius I, at the Battle of Marathon in 490 BC and to expand Persian territory into Greece. Faced with the impending Persian invasion, Greek city-states formed an alliance to defend their homeland. However, the alliance was fragile, with tensions and disagreements among the various city-states. The Spartans, known for their military prowess, were designated as the leaders of the Greek army. In August 480 BC, Xerxes reached Thermopylae and was met by the Greek force. Leonidas, realizing the overwhelming odds, decided to defend the narrow pass at Thermopylae, using the terrain to their advantage. The Spartans, along with their Greek allies, formed a formidable phalanx, a tightly packed formation of heavily armored hoplites. For three days, the Spartans and their allies held off the Persian onslaught. The narrow pass limited the Persians' ability to utilize their superior numbers, and the Greeks' discipline and fighting skills proved effective. However, on the third day, a Greek trader revealed a secret mountain path that allowed the Persians to bypass the Greek position. Knowing that their position was compromised, Leonidas decided to send most of the Greek army away to protect their cities. He remained with his 300 Spartans and a small contingent of soldiers to fight to the death. The Spartans fought valiantly, but they were eventually overwhelmed by the Persians. Although the Battle of Thermopylae was a defeat for the Greeks, it served as a crucial delay, allowing the Greek city-states to prepare for the upcoming Battle of Salamis, where the Greek navy decisively defeated the Persian fleet. The Battle of Thermopylae has become legendary, symbolizing courage, resilience, and the willingness to stand against overwhelming odds. The Battle of Thermopylae remains a pivotal moment in Greek history, showcasing the bravery and determination of the Greeks in the face of a much larger enemy. The legendary stand of the Spartans at Thermopylae continues to inspire and motivate people around the world.